Good morning. Welcome to Handmade by Julia Quinn on this um, Queen's Birthday public holiday. I'm an hour later because I got out of bed an hour later because it's a public holiday and because we've had rain and overcast weather and it was really nice to stay in bed and read for a bit. So if you're here, welcome. I'm glad to see you. If you're not, maybe you'll catch up with me later on in the day. Today I'm sharing with you another card making kit because we're still officially on school holidays and so I didn't want to do too much thinking and I have this kit to share with you three cards uh, I have already shared this kit with my team so there's only three cards left but this kit is the best remedy kit uh, a kit for all those occasions when you want to send someone best wishes when they're not feeling too flash it has gorgeous cute images and lovely bright colors and as always on the back of the instruction sheet there's these two great barcodes that you can scan if you're a beginner or if you want to learn about more about our kits and the supply list on the back complete with the coordinating colors and the coordinating colors are basic gray crushed curry granny apple green polished pink pool party and starry sky one of our new in colors okay let me get out the, the stamps for you there's this gorgeous uh, skunk raccoon I don't know sort of animal I think it might be a skunk and I'll just put it on the white so the stamps say a little birdie told me you were under the weather feel better soon I'm here for you uh, there's this skunk and ice cream ice cream in a tub and some flowers and a ice pack to put on your head sorry life stinks sometimes okay so that probably goes with the skunk as you can see i haven't used that one well this stinks well that stinks and then even though this stinks and then ice cream is the best remedy for this okay so we've got some stinky sayings to go with the skunk image and as always your kit comes with mini glue dots some die cut elements these are the spare bits left over some dimensionals and all, all the bits and pieces your block and starry sky ink and because i have the ink pad i'll use that instead and keep that one as a gift to give to my customers at some point okay so let's start with the first kit now i may change these a little i'm not sure how i'm feeling but here's the beautiful envelopes aren't they gorgeous a lovely i'm a i really do love gingham so the lovely gingham card and then the guard uh, granny apple green with the gingham and then this heart and this little dude here and they've got it actually they have got on theirs even though this stinks i'm here for you but we might change that to um hmm feel better soon i'm here for you or oh i don't know a little birdie told me you were under the weather feel better soon how about we do that was there another little banner in there no there wasn't so we have to stick all of it on the heart i've obviously lost that little banner or i can use this one this leftover one that's in here here we go there we are so i'm going to go i'm here for you feel or oh, feel better soon i like to feel better soon and I don't really like the stinky sayings actually but maybe if you were crook you would like them i'm just going to do a little birdie told me you were under the weather because i'll be able to use that one on the little birdie one as well okay and i'll get my stamp and piercing mat to stamp on too just so that i get a good image with my stamped images okay open up my starry sky ink and stamp a little birdie told me you were under the weather 
on the heart. That looks nice. And feel better soon on this one. I might just pop it over here so that I can see it. Feel better soon. There we are. Feel better soon. And now I just have to stick this one together. It's a pretty simple kit, this one actually, and I might put this up this way, I think. What do you reckon? Or does it look better that way? The way they've got it. Yes, of course, they've got it the right way. Stampin' Up! really do know what they're doing when they're creating their kits, don't they? Okay. Oh, I should have looked at the instructions, I suppose. That would have been a good idea. Okay. Let's see what the instructions say. Oops. I'm not being a very good teacher, am I? Okay. All right. There it is. Now, this little dude is on dimensionals. And I've got some little dimensionals here I can use. Pop him there. As you can see from the instructions, they've got dimensional images and then little dimensionals on this one. Okay, take the back off all of them. Okay, put you guys down there. And then, because we're going to half put that there and there, oh, my heart's a little crooked, I'm going to use a little bit of seal just on that end and I've got dimensional on that end so that it raises up to be the same height as this dude but then there we go and then we've got some there's my envelope for this one I've left myself at some flowers and sequins aren't they cute so I'll pop a couple of little flowers around. One, two, and another one down here. Three, and they've got sequins on here as well. That'll do. There we go, there's my first project complete. Okay, pop that one. So I just moved this box out of the way. I'll be able to put these ones over here and they're complete and you can still see them okay let's have a look at the next one this one is the little birdie a little birdie told me you were under the weather okay and this is the starry sky envelope with that beautiful detail on the flap there okay pop you underneath there out of the way gorgeous card front and then this is embossed as well on the back of that and then there and then there and then here we've got the same greeting that we used before a little birdie told me you're under the weather so we'll use that one definitely there we go the beautiful thing about the photopolymer is you can really see to line up the image which is great okay let's stick this one together now they've used mini glue dots on the back of this one so I'll put some seal there down the side da -da -da. and mini glue dots on the back of the granny apple green piece unusual choices of colors I'm not sure I would be brave enough to try these colours, but they certainly look amazing when you put them together on the cards. That's the best thing about the kits. It takes all of the thinking and the planning, and that's why I'm using them for my holiday break, because I'm not doing a lot of thinking or planning at the moment, but I've got the kits, and they allow me to keep creating I'm going to put you over this way because I like that overlap. And then the little birdie, he has dimensionals too. 
so yeah kits are great for the when your mojo's run away or when you want to have a break or a holiday i'm going to stick you under there underneath these little slippers cute slippers and a little ice pack on his head poor little birdie okay this one's got some sequins around artistically arranged and one There we go. Sparkles for the little birdie. I like that. That's cute. And then the third card in the kit is, let's find the instructions, Julia. Do the right thing. Is a little mouse who has a very, very good philosophy with crushed curry on the envelope. Crushed curry spots. There we are. Pop you under there. And beautiful candy striped card and which works really nicely with the mouse once again the polished pink panel is embossed so I'll stick that one on there we go one two yep that one goes first check the instructions Julia and then we've got the crushed curry piece that goes over the top there we go through the middle. Have I got everything straight? That will do. And then the little mouse is on dimensionals. And I have to find some more dimensionals because that one's empty now. Here we go. Oh, some big ones. And got that all done. Little mouse goes here on the side. She's a cute mouse, isn't she? She's got the little ice cream container. Oh, and I need to stamp. So once we've all got, and I will probably have to use the ice cream as the best remedy for this stamp. I don't think I really can use any others because it's just so cute. There we go. Ice cream is the best remedy. And the same, Starry Sky Ink. And pop that ice cream is the best remedy for this. There we are. I'll finish with my ink pad so I can close that. So that I don't accidentally stick any fingers into it. Okay, ice cream is the best remedy for this one. Two dimensionals. I wonder if I can tuck that. I might just... Oh. I want to chop off any. There we go. And then more sequins. Okay. And one, two, three, four. And another one down there. Odd number. Odd numbers apparently are the easiest for the human eye to appreciate as beauty they look more aligned for us and you know when you look at petals and plants in nature they quite often work in odd numbers which is probably why subconsciously we appreciate that perfection in those radio there's my cards and this is the best remedy kit and that was the best remedy for, t for me today on a public holiday, a sleeping in day and a holiday. The last day of my holidays, back to work tomorrow. Hopefully we'll have a proper video for you at 10 o'clock tomorrow. Bye bye now. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for everyone who was here. Thanks for saying hi and I'll comment to all of your comments after I've finished. Bye bye now.